how have you overcome all the challenges that you've experienced? I'm sure you must have experienced some challenges. Yes, I have. I have, honestly. Um, one of the major challenges I've experienced would be, you know, connecting with people. Because like you said, it is online. You don't see most of these people that you connect with, that you engage with. You don't know them. They don't know you. Yeah. How do they even know you're legit to start with? Exactly. You know, how are you able to project yourself, your brand in a way that people would see you and believe in what you're doing? Yes. So yeah. honestly, the way I've been able to overcome that is consistency. Right. right. Uh, if, I, if I was a fraud, I wouldn't come out every single day and just keep doing the same thing over and over and over and over again. You know, I'm not here to swindle anybody. I'm just... One hardworking lady trying to just, you know, do what she loves and everything. Mm. So consistency is one of the things that has kept me going. You know, another thing is, you know, engagement can be really discouraging, especially when you're starting out afresh. And then you, you take your time to post this wonderful picture and nobody's liking it. Nobody's commenting on it. Mm. And you begin to self-doubt yourself. Like, am I even doing it right? Am I supposed to be in this business at all? Mm. Yeah. So, but then again... um. I just keep going. I just keep doing what I'm doing. And the truth is it gets to a point when people just start to notice that brand. Yes. Yeah. Word of mouth and referrals, you know, they just come back to help you at the end of the day, to be honest. Like, I'll just say I keep doing what I can in the best way I can. And then when I encounter people that experience my service and really like what they've seen, they yes. get to tell other people. And these people come back again, you know, mm. and then that's just how it keeps going. Honestly, the, 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 the social media world, especially Instagram, you're right. It can be a lonely one. You can, you could feel like you've done everything and nothing is working out. Exactly. But just keep at it. Mm. Just keep at it. Consistency. That's it. I'll give you an example with the young cuisine page. When I started, yeah, I wasn't really getting likes. Nobody knew me. I was a new immigrant in Canada, right? I didn't right. even have friends for say. Mm -hmm. So I'm just here on this street trying to relate with strangers, looking for like-minded people. Exactly. And so I just kept doing my thing. I just kept mm -hmm. doing my thing. And I guess mm -hmm. when people just realize, okay, this girl is, or this babe, she's actually legit. She knows what she's doing. She has yes. a mission. She has a mission. Yeah. And they see that, okay, she's also here to help people and everything. I think that was just it, honestly. Exactly. And exactly. I, I can almost say I blinked and I went from 1,000 to where we are now because mm -hmm. it was just two years ago, I had just 1,000 followers, really. So it took me almost a year plus to get there. Yeah. And then from when I got to that point where people could actually recognize what I was doing mm -hmm. and see what my brand actually stood for and stands yeah. for the date, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the growth has now been much better. Right. So I think people just need to really see what you're doing. And that's mm -hmm. where consistency comes in. That is true. Very true. Very true. And one thing about um, trying to promote anything on, on, on social media, because they don't have that physical connection with you is um building that relationship on trust on like so they have to see you come out every time they have to see you posting every time they have to you have to you have to be in their face sometimes <laughs> True. True. <laughs> and they either like you or not like you but then when they like you then they trust you then they like your brand and then when they start to patronize you then they, you know, then see and know what your brand is all about. So yes, you're, 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 you're very, very, very right. You're very right. You're very, very right. That is so good. So when did you start? When did you start um, your entrepreneurship? Because I, you're my sister, rightly, as you said, and I know you and I saw you grow up and I, and I know that you've always been entrepreneur anyway, since when you were little, but when did you actually start, you know, start as a business? Well, um, I'd say as a business in Canada, uh, I'd like to limit it to that yes, <laughs> because if we yes. want to go all the way back. No, you don't want to go all the way back. back today. <laughs> <laughs> in Canada. So business in Canada, yes. I would say I officially started business in 2018. 
okay. um, September, yes. Right. Mm. And I started with the Young Cuisine. Um, and then moved on to also continue Claudia Zone by Charlie because I already had that from Nigeria. But of course, uh, when I got here, I stopped for a bit because right. new country, new people, I had to understand, you know, what's my target market? What do I even want to sell on this platform mm -hmm. and everything? Yes, so, yes, yeah. yes, yes. I officially started every single thing I'm doing now in 2018. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, that's good. So basically, when you got to Canada in 2018, you started, but truthfully, you've been doing it all along anyway. So it's something that is inbuilt uh -huh. in you. When you yeah. go to Canada, you can't just put it aside. <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't. Yeah. <laughs> so how um, do you go on? Go on. Go on. Okay, yeah. sorry. I was just going to say, and then Niger Premier actually started like maybe 14 months ago. It's still pretty new. Right. But because of that existing trust, like you mm -hmm. rightly said, yeah. because I've been able to you know, build a community on Yum Cuisine, on other pages. So when yeah. I started Niger Premier, the, the love was just overwhelming. And, you know, everybody willingly came and followed and, you know, they've been a part of the journey. Yes. And we recently just hit 3,000 followers as well on that page. Or rather wow. 3,000 community members strong. Yes. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So it's it's amazing. The growth has been really amazing, I must say. Yeah. Yes, 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 yes. It's amazing. It's amazing to see um, your community grow because you are one of those that have, I um reckon with from the start so it's like i know you from zero growing all the way so yes it's really amazing how you did that um so i know you work in the corporate world so how are you handling <laughs> yes, it <I> do. <laughs> <laughs> well honestly everything has been good i have to be honest with you um merging my my corporate life my professional life and my <laughs> business Mm -hmm. has never been something that I struggle with because okay. like I said I've always done I've always done this even way back in Nigeria and here though I'd say it's a bit easier because on Fridays for instance I close at 1 p.m so oh. that gives me ample time to go and take care of deliveries like everything I need to ship out uh -huh. I just rush straight and go and post out <laughs> everything that needs to go out. <laughs> you know so that 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 Friday that two to oh. five window is like it's mm. just bliss because my business has my attention 100%. And because I run my business online as well, you know, I'm able to fulfill orders at any time. Right? Yes. So if somebody was to order today, I don't mind staying up extra hours just to put everything and package it and have it ready mm -hmm. to be shipped out like the next day or the day after, whatever the case may be. Yeah. So it, honestly, I wouldn't, it hasn't been um, difficult in any way. I have to be honest, it has been easy because it is online right so yeah yes. yeah and also because it's a growing business right so it's not like yes. i have to fulfill a thousand orders no. um alongside my job right so yeah mm, 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 mm. okay oh well, that's good to know 